and it was an option to get a window here but i didn't do that just because of the opening i felt like i needed a another wall to like put something since i won't have this complete wall let me get my um i never have my starbucks app loaded i feel like it's always depleted child thank you can i have a straw as well please thank you have a good one Hi hey guys, welcome to March Forever. My name is Tiana, I hope all is well. If you are new here, please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and join the March Forever family. I'm so excited that you guys came back if you guys are not new. <laughs> so in today's video guys, we're actually gonna be going into one of the homes that is not the model to see some of the upgrades that we chose, the structural upgrades. So we kinda did this before with the design center, but um, hmm we didn't look at the all of the structural things that we didn't choose or those homes that we could see didn't have our structural upgrades so the scary part about building a new home is that you only can really see the model the house with all the upgrades you don't really know how your house is going to look without some of those upgrades so it's kind of like a surprise at the end um but you know how i am i'm just not that patient um and i really wanted to measure for furniture as well so i can order some of those things i want now because of all of the delays and stuff um and so we're gonna go in and basically see these spaces the biggest things we want to see is the size of the mud room we want to see the first floor bedroom and we also want to see the living room morning room combination without the living room extension and the model the living room had an extension and it had a vertical beam which i don't like and the morning room looks more like a bump out so i just want to see what that looks like when it's actually like a real um it's a real like morning room without the living room extension those are the biggest things that i really want to see um everything on the second floor that was in the model we're getting so it looks the same it's really the first floor that i want to see so if you guys are interested in this type of content keep on watching so you can see my impatient but look at the house that's similar to ours <laughs> all right guys see you guys in the all right guys so this is the way the office will look right by the door we will have that opening right there and it was an option to get a window here but i didn't do that just because of the opening i felt like i needed a another wall to like put something since i won't have this complete wall and then right here the difference will be is that we will need um we will have a third window right here and this third window will be here and upstairs in our master so we have the extra window but it's just there not there and so I wanted this walkway because I just didn't want anything closed off and I just wanted lights to flow from the front and the back to the back of the house. This will be the little butler's pantry space. Sorry, it's not for, oh, there we go. But we left it blank. That was an upgrade that we did not choose. Um, this will be the layout of the first floor, the family living space. This was important for us to see because the model had the extension and we didn't like that because one, it had a vertical beam. I do not like beams and it only let the morning room appear to be like a bump out. So with this, it's like a clear, oopsie, a clear um, morning room separated by this right here, this space here. It's like the breakfast area. So over here is going to be the kitchen and um, it is standard to have a double sided, like the double sided island with the um, storage. So we'll have cabinets on both sides. That was standard. Um, and all of these lights were standard. We got capstones that are recessed lights. All of those were standard, but I absolutely love this morning room and family room with no extension layout. And all of the windows are like almost floor to ceiling. They go really low, which I didn't realize. Like they are right at my calf, if you can see. 
they're like right there in my calf and they're six feet tall and about two and a half um, feet wide okay this is another upgrade right here um i think this is a little different but basically i think our wall will actually be a little bit more open right here because we don't want a door to go here so i think in this house she'll have a door right here but we didn't want a door right there so just like the model this will be like open so again all of the light is just flowing from the front to the back of the house all right so going this way this is where the garage is so it'll be similar we'll just have a third car um this space right here is standard and this is the space we won't have because we're getting a first floor bedroom i mean be a bedroom with a bathroom and so basically this will be closed off and it'll just be a regular closet right here we won't have this family center because we have a bathroom right here so this will be the size of the first floor bedroom which is the same size as our last bedroom on the first floor this window is standard this window is standard and this will be a closet because they'll just have a study but in our home this will be cut in half and there will be a closet here and then this will be an opening to enter the bathroom. Okay, I'm gonna try to go downstairs and see. So downstairs is gonna be very similar to ours because this person is leaving theirs unfinished so there'll be a door here. And this is basically how the unfinished space will look. We will have a walk out as well. Sorry for the darkness, it's really bright outside, but all these windows are standard. And this is what a walk out will look like, guys. So no steps, just walk right out to your backyard. Our master will be the same with the sitting room and deck. Closets and bathroom will be the same. One master closet. Another. And then we'll have a standard shower like this. So it won't be that spa shower from the model. Walk-in closet. Um, vanities. And we'll have a freestanding tub. So just like downstairs in the office. The office is below here. We will have a window there as well. All right, guys. So I hope that that was helpful to see what some of the upgrades look like. Um, I will try to insert pictures of, like, for example, what the morning room, living room combo looks like with the extension. I'll also try to insert a picture of what that open stairwell to the basement looks like from the model as well because I don't believe she has that and if she does it looks different than I imagined. Um, but thank you guys for tuning in today to see what our upgrades will look like and get a feel for a space. I did also measure but it was too much so I couldn't record that. I did get some good measurements of the windows so that we can like think about certain window treatments we want. I was able to measure the office the morning room the i didn't have to me measure the family room or the first floor bedroom um but i also measured out that um butler's pantry as well um and i measured out that breakfast area as well because those measurements are not on the blueprint that they gave us um so yeah so just stay tuned for our next video um and i'll see you guys later bye Right by your side, the thick and the thin I'll cherish you right till the end That's all I need for you to believe in my family We're